welcome, and welcome back to all that the wind has brought here, to another episode of Roots of Pacha, where it's time we're going to cut down some more trees. But first, we have a new baby, and this time it's not an animal. Pacha has blessed us with a new baby girl. So let's go and meet her. Oh, how precious. And Teddy and Grandpa are here. That's adorable. I have no idea where that heart came from. Because I had the mirror in the way. My bad. Oh, Grandma. A new life has joined your family, and that new life needs your care and attention. It may take a village to raise a child, but they are not a replacement for your love and care. Your newborn will still call for you between 3 and 4 p.m. and need your care. If you check on them, you'll start with a stronger bond when they first become toddlers. If you don't, they'll be fussy and you'll wake up tired the next day. It's Pachin custom for the shaman to name the clan's babies. You can talk to Vuok to suggest a name. After two weeks have passed and you have choos chosen a name, your baby will have a ceremony to become more independent. Uh, a more independent toddler. All right. Well, we'll meet our new baby shortly. Let's first ditch some stuff though, before we go and play with the baby. We have 17 silver, that's not terrible. I mean, it's not great. But it's not terrible. Let's come down to our house real quick. And let's come meet our little baby. We'll also say hi to Carmel and Lily. And Shadow on our way out, at least. I can't stop smiling. We have a baby! Jelred and Mana do hang out a lot. My grandma seems to think they're more than friends. No. Hmm. Aww, we can change their clothes. Well, of course it's gotta be blue, right? Well, maybe. Maybe purple. Ooh, I like purple for the baby. Let's put the baby in purple. Shadow went outside. There we go. And stream can help us come on up here. And look, we got a detour flower. We can go ahead and give that to Vuok. Uh, uh, yeah, sure. One chili there and you know what? One egg. Sure. And we'll process the garlic up. Okay, nothing to deal with there. So let's grab out these two things. We'll get some more beans going. Excellent. We'll get some vinegar going. And then we'll put that away. And we'll grab that out. All right, and it's a happy Friday, and we don't have anyone to really deal with a whole lot, except for our animals here. That horse has fleas. I'm not too incredibly concerned with that. There is this horse here. All 
All right. <laughs> and that'll settle everything for us there. The pineapples in the jungle are probably about grown. We should probably go collect those. Pomegranates and almonds. And that's it. That's okay. Um, nobody in here really that we need to deal with. I mean, eventually, yes. Of course we do. However, at the moment, not so much. It's about time to start rearranging, but that's okay. We're almost there. I think in this room I actually do need to play the flute with the baby guanaco. Oh, I don't. Okay, that works. That's fine. <clears throat> and we will ditch you here. Put away the ferment. And then almonds and pomegranates will collect up. Okay. And all of our lovely pomegranates. And then a little run over here. Where we'll put in half of these and all of this. And the Alma. And a half of these. Perfect. As we scroll down, we have dealt with Grob. Bada has an event for us. That's cool. We'll go and deal with that. And Zelk is here today, so that's good. So we'll deal with Zelk. We'll hopefully deal with Bada's event. We'll hopefully deal with Grub, and then we'll deal with the baby. And of course, it's Vox's birthday, so we'll try and deal with him at some point today. Nari creates magic when she works, even more so now that she's working closely with everyone. That's fair. Would you like some injera? All right, and let's trade. Let's buy all of that, and I don't need your flint. I mean, no flower isn't a terrible idea. At least it would be more flower. Okay. There's Buak. Happy birthday. Have you thought about what the clan should name your child? Yes. Our child is going to be Ivy. I like that name a lot. A gift with positive intent makes a good birthday even better. Thank you. Pacha gave Garrick many gifts. I'm glad Jen and Grob are finally noticing. Ada and I had some extra herbs. Oh, thank you. That's flea medication. That's what that is. Um, hmm. We're gonna need a lot of silver. We could do this, I think. Let's go take a look at our agate and see if we can upgrade our pendant of luminescence. That would at least get something out of our way. Mm, yeah, we can do that. We can definitely do that. That works great. All right.
Now everything just needs the advanced level. That'll be awesome. All right. That's all of that. Now let's go see if there even is a brub today. He is here and he is on the beach. So let's go check that out. And then it's about time to deal with the baby. Wow, I went totally too far. I went way the wrong way. It's fine. To be a navigator, you need to observe the world around you. Clouds, birds, and the ocean swells all hint the way. That's fair. Okay, we've got some chitons. I think we already have that for sure, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's done. Okay. Don't need that. Thank you. So, the last thing we could do before dealing with the baby is take a look at where Vada is and see if she wants to just hang out. And we have an hour to do that. And then I guess we'll cut down some trees because there are some trees to cut down, which is good news. Is it exciting news? Less so, but it's good news. It's a little weird to be so far from other Pachin clans. This land is spectacular. Hmm, I don't know what her event's gonna be, so that's fine. I'm trying to wait until after we deal with the baby because I don't wanna waste my mushroom tarts. That'll do. Who can come in the house? We'll check on him. No? I mean, the kid's unconscious, so that's good. So we can nurse the baby and we can change the baby's diaper as well. That's cool. What does Pacha have to say? You have your hands full with the baby at the moment. Okay. So, that means that it's time. It's time. Let's do it. Because if we look here, that's 26% hardwood chance. I think we get more if we put it in the boost spot, but that's fine. 26 will do. That's more than one in every four. And besides, with our rather fantastic lunch or with our rather fantastic gemstones and things too but our lunch not only are we getting hardwood from softwood trees but we're also just getting more hardwood in general we're getting more drops which is really nice There's another 80. It's 
see this proves that they don't grow all in a line either. There's no specified timer. Because if there was a specified timer, then a whole bunch of trees in a line all pumped together like these would have grown. Because that's how I chopped them down. And so, therefore, that can't be the case. Which is fine. It's not a big deal. There's still plenty of trees for us to chop. Um, that's birch. I'm stuck in a field. That's fine. Okay. I think that's all. So we'll go to the forest and eat some more mushroom tarts. That's easy enough. We can do that. And then it shouldn't be long before we have enough. Plenty of wood to cut down around here. Oh yeah, this is way better. That's our first regular wood. That's pretty good. Let's take this one up. And we'll keep cutting down trees. We're almost done with it, honestly. It's also almost time for us to head home, but I'd like to try and get at least 200 hardwood if I can. Oh man, I jinxed it, didn't I? I must have jinxed it. Oh no! Come on, earring! Work for me, friend! Ah. <sighs> Still nothing. There we go. That'll do. All right, just a little bit more. I think that should do us fairly well. We'll go ahead and head back. And in fact, I am going to cut the video just a little bit because I'm going to see how close we are to getting that shed finished. And I will be right back. All right, we are back. We almost have gotten enough. We're almost there. We are so close. I just tried to go in Kroll's house again. It's alright. We'll crawl in the bed with the baby. It's gonna bring us up to 1,459, almost 60,000 clan prosperity. And we contributed 4582 today. We'll get some sleep. Back up over 200,000. 
and we will awaken. To another new baby! Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it, and we are almost done cutting down trees. I promise we need to cut down trees for one more day, and then in the next episode, we will be revealing what is inside of the secret sheds, and we'll start to rearrange some animals as well. But that's going to have to wait for the saving of the game and the ending of the day. We've come to the end of the episode. If you guys like what you see, please feel free to hit that thumbs up. If you'd like to see more, consider subscribing. And if you'd like to place your opinion and your vote on what we should play next, that is available on the community page. But until next time, may the wind bring you on another journey. And have a good night.